So Jeff, what's your top three tips for design <laughs> process? Uh, I'm Josh Abilda here in New Zealand and I'm building a house for my very first subscriber, Jeff. We're taking a behind the scenes peek at what uh, the process is like for us. <laughs> so Jeff, you've just recently been through design yep, um, yep. And with Prime Designs. Yep. And so what do you think about the design process? I think the, the early stage of the design process was probably more detailed than we thought it would be coming from an outside perspective we've got no idea did you kind of think that they would just draw some boxes on paper and then we'd work this rest out later or? i suppose we hadn't really given it that much thought as to what, what would happen at that point but we should just touch on that's why we're making these videos because yeah. it's been really good for me to go through this process with jeff and for us to talk together about like what Jeff thought would happen and, and how that didn't quite meet his expectations so that we can better explain that to future clients. There's some things we need to know like the flooring detail and the fireplace and then there's other things we don't need to know like the colour of paint that's going on the wall or the yeah. roof colour and I think what you're saying is you struggled with like well which things do we need to know yeah, now correct. versus later. What do I need to know and so I just went through the plans in detail and just tested all of my assumptions with you that this is what we think this room will be like and do you need to know this now or not. So Jeff, what's your top three tips for design <laughs> process? Uh, one is uh, don't worry about the number of revisions. And so um, we did feel a little bit guilty. Like, oh, we're, um, the, the team here were great. And I know that we felt a little bit, oh, they've, they've put together this nice design and we're gonna go back and say, no, we want this here or there. Or at some point it was as simple as this door I'd rather open from the other side. But then I thought to myself, we're gonna be living in this place. And so we do, want to get it right now and I, I shouldn't just think to myself oh, I can just fix that later on. Um, number two was it was really helpful for us to come and do a 3D walkthrough of the property um, and so when you're looking at the plans it's really hard to get a gauge for the amount of space in each room or how they work with each other or even just where the windows are placed so we actually came into Prime and um, it took us through on the computer how, how the house will look, kind of like they took the roof off and then you're just looking at it from, from that point of view. And then what was the third tip? I suppose just talking through everything and just showing either the build or designer every idea you've got. And so we had no idea about we want this big, amazing, beautiful window, for example. Is that going to be an extra thousand dollars or an extra hundred thousand dollars? And we've just got no idea. And so we would show it to Josh and some of the things we were surprised that actually that doesn't cost much more. And so we'll do that. And other things were a lot more than we thought they were going to be. So that uh, didn't make the cut. And of course, we'd been um, on Pinterest spinning so many different ideas and, and some of them uh, worked uh, with our house and some didn't. All I'm hearing from that is talk to your builder early on. <laughs> that's good. It's a good plug for you. <laughs> that's the perfect spot to cut this video short. No more needed to say. Let's go. <laughs> Done. Mm-hmm.